Good evening and welcome to Gray Barn Antiques. Today is Friday, April 21st, and we're going to visit with our vendor, Burning Sensation Antiques, who goes by the vendor code of UGMO. They are a 20% off vendor, items not marked firm. We are located in Andover, New Jersey, which is Sussex County, Upper North Jersey, closer to PA, exit 25 off of Route 80. We are open all year round, Wednesday through Sundays, 10 to 5 during the week and 10 to 5.30 on the weekends. We do ship the smaller items. If you would like to have anything shipped and you're curious about how much it will cost, you can either shoot me a message with your zip code and I can send you some scenarios, or you can also check out for yourself on USPS.com and do some playing around on there to get an idea of the pricing. We are also located on Facebook under Gray Barn Antiques, that's gray with the E, and you'll see in the on our videos, there's a little bright green with a little puppy dog. That's our little cinnamon -y. And those are the replays of our Wednesday night Facebook Lives at 5.30. We do those every Wednesday night. They last about a half an hour to 45 minutes, and it's usually uh, in including the items that I've, I find around the shop that might have been marked down nicely, reduced significantly now. I think they're a great deal at the, at, you know, all of our stuff's a great deal, but now they're even better deal. They're almost a steal. And a lot of the new items that come in, because most of our vendors come in at least once or twice a week. And after a busy weekend, Wednesday and Thursday seem to be our bigger stocking days and lots of stuff comes in. We're also on Instagram at Gray Period Barn and you're watching us on our Gray Barn Antiques YouTube channel. So please be sure to give us a subs uh, subscribe and be alerted to all the new content that does come out on our channel. You can also call us at 973-786-5555. And you can also find all this information on our website, www.graybarnantiques.com, or send us an email at graybarn at graybarnantiques.com. Just remember, it's always gray with the E, and you'll find us easily. So again, we're going to visit with Burning Sensation Antiques. They have two shelves in the locked case room. And tonight, for once, I remember to actually unlock the cases. Oh, let me just show you these guys really quick. They like this weird little plastic, but they're nice for uh, ring displays for just $8. They are new. They're hollow, but you know, if you uh, need a ring holder, we got those cute ones there for just $8. Some essential oils. And like I said, we're going to go into the case room. May 6th and 7th, the shops in Andover will all be doing... We have uh, two big events every year. We have in June, the first, it's the 8th, and I'm not sure, 8th and 9th, whatever that Saturday and Sunday is, that's the Summer Marketplace. And that's one of the large events. And then every year, Columbus Day weekend is our other large event that all the shops participate. We decide to do some smaller events, but have really great sales that are, you can only get inside the shop. A lot of our vendors do an additional 10% off on top of their already great prices. We'll have a couple of guest vendors outside. The other four shops will also be doing some things. So if you're local, definitely mark your calendar. We have some other events that we'll be doing throughout the summer, special sales, not like big events, but things that you can grab some good deals on. And every uh, first Sunday of the month is Scranberry Coop's uh, Flea Market on Sunday mornings. So be sure to check that out as well. So, like I said, he has two shelves, and I actually remembered to unlock the door so we can actually not have a reflection and kind of get in here a little bit more and see what's in here. Redware Bean Pot for just $6.40. That's a really good little deal on that. I don't know that maker's mark, but that's cute. It's glazed inside. That is a very good deal on that little piece of pottery. I've seen these go for a lot more than that. He just brought in some stuff uh, today as well. So, this little shot, this little cap gun just came in, and that's $40. These are the little toothpick picker uppers. So these little bobs is he's got a little spring loaded in there, and he's just 16. Fantastic bells. This one you just do the very pretty, and that's $40. Now he gets his brass is vintage. He just gets it super shiny, as I've mentioned in other videos. So that's the kind that you watch them bang it all the time. And some uh great things back there. And again, it is 20% off the items you see in here. And we do take PayPal and uh, for our customers that we're shipping to, as well as if you need to, uh, if you want to use a credit card, just call us during business hours and we run those through our machine. And of course, if you're local and you're picking up, we do take cash. This is a nice little needle box. I haven't seen this before. It's file company. It's Nicholson file box with files, $4.80. Ah, very nice. Let me see if I can get that to focus. It doesn't want to focus. Goodness, it's like a game here for this. Anyway, it says Nicholson USA on the bottom. That's a good deal on that. 
and there's a lot of good deals in here, but that's that's a nice piece right there. We actually, I had, this, it's getting a little later in the day. I had meant to do this earlier, but we got super busy at the end of the day. And a lot of the busy were dealers from other shops. We get a lot of dealers shopping from other places as well as uh, they have online presence and stuff. So got a little busy at the end of the day there, which was fantastic. This is adorable at just $16. It's got good weight to it. It's a hammered copper, not marked. It's got some nice age to it. And again, if I go past something that you want more information on, and it doesn't have to just be from this particular vendor tonight, let me know and I will gladly get you that information. That's cute. Film. I love, I have a thing for little tins. I try to control myself, but it's really hard in here to, to not buy everything. There's so much good stuff. I love stuff. It's 1800s Bon Bonnier for $20. And a lot of the, the, all the stuff in the shelves that I'm showing you right now, these are shippable, so. Cute little pig for $12. Nice cut to clear for $22.40. $32. And it's got the match strike. So you would strike your, there's the strike. It's right on his thing here. Yeah, looks like it's on his front. Oh, it's got the double divider in there. This has got some really cool color to it. It like changes colors in the light. 1440 a lot of great oil well, that's a cute little lamp for just twelve dollars there that little yellow one there we go sharing form formalin lamp and that is 60 and that is patented in 1899 so that's pretty interesting little oil lamp there type oil lamp don got the biggest kick out of this piece of glass 1995 uh, oval art glass for 20. So you got the this deer being lassoed, and if you turn it, you can see he's etched on the front here, the, his captor. So, all right. So those are his shelves in the case room. Oh, and a couple of good deals on these Hummels. They're just 960. These are the older ones. They have the bases. A lot of times now you don't see the bases on them. So those are just 960 each. And again, we are visiting with Burning Sensation Antiques. Uh, it was in today. Don actually, oh, there's a couple things here that have to fit back into this booth that are outside. We have a piece of iron gate here, fencing, for uh, $60. And then this box for $55, so that'd be $44. It's a nice old oak box. Some stuff Don has to put away. Don was working on all three of his booths today as Ron brought in a lot of stuff. So a lot of... New old stuff. This is the inside of a chest, it looks like. Yep, the old tray for 32. So this is booth, this is the biggest of his three booths, and this is on this side of the shop. So if you come into the shop, you'd head to the right, and this would be this one here. So. And again, this is Burning Sensation Antiques. He is a 20% off items not marked firm. And everything I'm showing you is for sale except for his shelving. I did feature these individually. I went through and got the measurements and prices on all of these items that you're seeing right here on these three shelves a couple weeks ago on our Instagram Facebook page. When I say Instagram Facebook, I'll put it up on Instagram and it feeds over to Facebook. So whichever you use, if you use both, I know Facebook's a lot easier to, uh, Instagram's a lot easier to look at. $12 for that nice one gallon two-tone jug. Some great banks, a lot of Lennox. The Lennox is priced to move. And this is the older Lennox, it's the USA. So, this is pretty. It's got a lot of great stoneware, saltware, uh, cobalt, yellowware. And that bird was on our Facebook Live on Wednesday night, if he looks familiar. Ooh, what's this thing? What does that say? 40 early barrel sifter top oh that's really cool oh that is part of this this handle is part of this this has got this great old wood this metal this is beautiful and that is just 32 dollars look at this this is very shaker box style on that but i know a lot of people that's a great price on that it's not a repro that's an actual antique piece here and that's just 32 dollars for that you got a lot of great crates a lot of great Great greats, <laughs> great greats and great crates. Say that 10 times fast. It's a nice, this I showed this before. What I like about this, it has your skimmer on it as well. 
So as you can see, you'll notice, like I did this booth a month ago, some of the things are still here. They've just kind of moved around. Uh, Ron did go through last couple weeks and he's been marking some stuff down, mostly in the other um, booth, so. And if you do, if you don't do uh, screenshots, if you, you know, if you're not able to do that, just let me know at what point in the video you saw an item, just so I have an idea of what to pull and pull, pull and get more information for you, because I like to make sure you have more information if you need it. It's an oil can for 20. And I will send you more pictures if you, if you want. We get you the measurements, all that. We will gladly help you out and get you your treasures. hand has a little bit of shakes tonight. Yeah, really busy at the end of the day. This is a nice thing, $12 on that. That's unusual. Nice little match, cast iron match holder there for 12. I apologize if there's a little bit of shaking going on. This just came in today. This is a great uh, wrought iron uh, piece here for just $24. I'll step back so you can get the view of that. It's very cool. Got great lighting in here. And if the light, if the wiring is older, right across the street at Made in the Shade, they do uh, rewiring on those. Some of them you can actually do it yourself. You can just find it online. You can go onto YouTube and you can get the parts. You can get them off of Amazon uh, or you can go over to your Home Depot or Lowe's, local hardware store, and just rewire those lamps yourself if you need to. What is this? Antique welder's hammer. Those are nine sixty each. Don's like, you gotta see this. He goes, the the, the print is on the inside, so this is twenty eight. So you see plain on the outside, but nobody's buying it for the outside. When you're making your chocolate or whatever you're making, you want the feathers to show. So this is a great little mold for twenty eight dollars. Ooh, nice little old box of chalk. Feels like it's all in there for four bucks. A stereoscope. molds and again tins I love tins I do have some I don't have a whole not, I've not gone crazy on them I do wanna, they have a lot of collections I always you know you have these saying you don't you know, <clears throat> don't trust a skinny chef don't trust a antique shop uh, owner who doesn't collect as well right <laughs> gotta collect something right and again, this is Burning Sensation Antiques. You'll see in the upper left-hand corner, vendor code is UGMO, and they are a 20% off vendor, off of items not marked firm. Very few uh, firm items in this booth. We try to get our dealers to only do firm on things that are $5 and under. Because to me, that's reasonable. You know, two, three dollars firm is more than reasonable. It's a nice galvanized pail for just $16. Oh, it's, it's got the, spigot hole here very cool nice kettle for 24 that one we're not gonna probably be able to ship I mean it's it weighs a lot and it's just a large item a couple shutters Got all this great stuff over here the funnel bottles for your oil for 32 this thing just came in today Bunsen Davy burner has original wick for 24 very cool, look at that. And then Don was very diligent in putting all the planes lined up together and got those all done nicely. Very, a very nice little display here. I want you to see his how nice that looks. You think my house looks like that, but no, it doesn't. <laughs> when you're in this business, if you're a seller, uh, you kind of lose your house unless you have a lot of storage or you have an outbuilding. We don't have either, so <laughs> it's our house is full. 16 on this nice old scale. 
36 for the ammeter. It does have a shatter in the glass. That's the original box. Fourteen forty on the Wisconsin two quart milk can. Pack that in your lunch box. This thing, the scale just came in today, and that is thirty six. And Don brought it up to me, and he very excitedly said, "Yes, we can ship this." I'm just gonna get these lights over here. So when I go to the other side, I only have that one side. Oh, I wanted to show you these as well. I almost forgot about these two guys. These are they just came in today. They are sad iron heaters. So this one is on sale for sixty. And this one is on sale for 80. So missing the cap. But this is what you would use to keep your little stove. Look how cute that is. It looks like a little stove to keep your sad irons nice and warm for while you're doing your ironing. I think there might be some. I don't know if he has any of the hardware left up here. He had some. So we got some of his handles are up here, a pair of the cast iron handles. Oops, for eight dollars. So it's one, two, three sets. They are numbered one, three, eight, eight if you have something that that fits on. So those are also from Burning Sensation. As you can see, we keep the, the knobs and stuff all in one spot, and everybody in there is at least 20% off. So if you saw something while I was going by that you want, just let me know. So now we're gonna head on over to his back booths. And you can see as we're walking up, Burning Sensation, because of the repair, he gets all these lights working, all these oil lamps that you see hanging are functioning. Isn't this beautiful? And they have the chimney tops on them. This is the, I love this one, the double one there. Look at that, isn't that just gorgeous? That glass, just beautiful. So I'm gonna step back and see if we can't get both booths into the shot. Sorry if I waggle a little bit. I, I gotta look where I'm walking because <laughs> otherwise you will hear crash, bang, boom, and not in a good way. So he's got these two booths here. Just brought that table in. We'll look at that as we come around to that spot. So as I've said before, this is not new in reproduction, copper or brass. He just gets it this shiny. So I was looking at this when he brought it in. What is this? An early wood tool for polishing, for pushing grain off, off the floor at 32. Or Okay, that's pretty cool. So we got all this great, oh, this table's 120, this great top on it. It's on a sewing machine treadle. But look at this thing. Here's your bed warmer for 24, British made. Look how shiny that is. I like this little guy. It's just 1440. Very pretty. His hat stands were just reduced. This one's not been yet, but these guys were from 18 down to 10, so it's just $8 for any it is. And I did feature those as well on our Facebook and Instagram page. Ooh, look at you, you're pretty. 80, needs rewiring, so that'd be 64. Manhattan brass, student lamp with a nice old shade. It is a nice old shade, look at that, it's so pretty. Love that cranberry glass on that. And he does make all these tables, repurposes them. I'm just gonna kill this light though, since I'm here. I like this one, this is funky, this little, it's got a great 60s, 70s flare to it, $32. Does have the toggle switch. Right now it's kind of peachy pink, and when we turn it off, it's more pink. The pink egg. Milk from Orc style. And more copper and brass, all nicely polished. Cocktail shaker. And you'll notice some of these things I have featured in the past. And you'll also notice some new items have snuck in between. Like I said, don't be shy, reach out to us. We'll gladly answer any questions that you happen to have. Uh, if we don't get to you right away during business hours when the shop is open, we're just really, we're having a good problem, we're busy. So, but we're not ignoring you and it must be, 
you can either email us, like I said, or direct message us on Facebook or Instagram. I do have the comments open as well. So if you, I do believe YouTube is supposed to notify me when I get comments. So if you see it, you can also do that as well. And we will gladly get back to you on any questions you have. Measurements, whatever you want, we will get that for you. We even have shipped gifts for people. Happy mail we've sent out for people. We'll make sure the packaging, although it might not be wrapped like to, to you know to the nines, we do make it that's a very pretty presentation. That's really pretty. Made in Boston, Christmas 1890. Goodness. Oil, add oil and light. So he's got this one functioning. That's 120. Look at that. How beautiful is that? That's just stunning. Absolutely stunning. A lot of enamelware, a lot of cast iron. We're getting to that time of the year where the parks start opening up around here. And they all, all the campers start showing, so we can see there is some. Not too bad, not too many scratches. So that'd be 24. You do have some mild paint loss on that one. And this looks like the Americana with the gold. This one does have a lot more scratches, as you can see. And we hold it up to the light. And that's also 24. A lot of great. Hand kitchen tools there, primitives, nice Dutch oven. It does have a lot of pitting down there, so it does need a little help if you want to use that. I would not use it as it is right now. All right. Got a lot of great milk bottles. Mount Bethel, New Jersey for 12. Moyer Dairy Company for 12. Uh, Newark, that one's also 12. White House Station bottle for 20. The Amber Coin Oval Bowl from Frostoria. We, this is the, they have other colors. Here's some amber for you for just 16 each on those. A lot of mason jars. So if my cousin's watching this, 15 becomes 12. These have the zinc and porcelain in them. Whitney Mason, that's an unusual one. 1440. Putnam Lightning for 960. I am gonna just show these because I do have somebody who was interested in them and this is actually the easier way for me to do this than trying to get her the pictures. 960, what is that a, doesn't have a. It's a nice aqua for 960. He's got great prices on these. And we do ship, oops, we do ship these. Sorry about that thud. This is a clear glass dray. That one's just $6.40 for the pint with the lid. These all have lids that I'm showing you, which is awesome. My arm's getting a little tired. Okay, I'm not gonna go through all because I'm looking at another shelf of them. So if you want more information on those, just let me know. Some pint, oh, Moyer Dairy then is out of Easton. So how much is this little guy? I like the little guy on the back. Do you know? Our drivers sell golden Guernsey milk, light cream, heavy cream, chocolate milk, buttermilk, and cottage cheese. Eight dollars for that bottle there. And that's a print. This is a embossing. Long Branch, New Jersey. That's the. Uh, is that Elsie? Our cottage cheese is so good. Hotmans, you can kind of see in the light there. Golden Guernsey for sixteen. And more mason jars. So if you want more information on those, just let me know. This is a set, the rooster and the chicken, and they are, uh, is that five zero? Yeah, so that's 40 for the pair, so 20 each on those basically. Nesting hen, she needs a little bit of soap, but she's a nice one, she's just $12. And this one's just eight, they just reduced her. A nice crock for just $40. They make great garbage cans, and this cast iron doorstop for $17.60. This table, that I was talking about just came in. How interesting is that? The two shelves, one's actually round. So there's a the split in the wood, which you'd find because a lot of times these are like two pieces. And uh, that's just what happens with them. 64, it is an antique. The turning, look at how beautiful that is with the bead work on that. And he brought a ton of these different ashtrays today. They all have the little pushies on them. So, and he cleaned them up spectacularly. This is 20 for that one. This one is 24. This should spin. Yep, pretty much. This one's actually 
favorite manufacturing company has the phone number on it from that company. This is what? Grass cigarette dispenser dispenser. So we're going to lift that and your cigarette's going to pop on out. And that one's 28. And this is just the regular little dumping one for uh, 20. So this is just the back of that. And you can see there's a couple more pieces in the side of that cabinet as well, that shelving. And again, this is Burning Sensation Antiques. Let's come over here so you can see these teapots. And you can see they've been redlined. This is a nice one for just $8. It's taped on there. I want to see what this one. No markings, but this is a nice older one. I'm not seeing any condition issues with that. That's just $8. It's pretty blue. It's a nice vintage blue. So, and then 20 becomes 16. 14 becomes 11, 20. 12, it becomes 9, 16. 10 becomes 8. So if any of those piques your interest, let me know. Cute little planter girl for 16. There's another teapot back there for 9, 60. Small chip on lids. So they made that just $5 firm. And it feels like ironstone. There's the chip. Let's see. It looks like Knowles, is it? Or virtuous porcelain. That's a good deal on that. That is a very good deal on that, even with that little chip. Fantastic deal on that, and that's just $5. And these vases last year were going like crazy. I found a no price. This might be part of a set. Oh, it is part of a set. Wow, that's a good deal on that set. That is $8. Am I seeing that right? Hold on, folks. Sorry about that. The tag is getting away from me. $8 for the little pitcher and the little vase or toothbrush holder. That's a fantastic deal on that. And that print is on both sides. That has got some nice age to it. Syracuse China. A nice restaurant wear. Dogwood. And that one is $12. Another teapot for eight. Missing a lid. $14.40 on that. Cute little plant stand. $38 and then 20% off. Nice clock. How much are you? Oi! $40. So, wow, that's just $32. They sold syrups, 22 and 25 firm. Button jars for 12. The jars alone without the buttons are worth that. So you're getting a good deal there. Mr. Peanut jar for 320. It doesn't have his picture on it, but it must say it on the bottom. Let's see. I know these are very collectible. So yep, there he is. That is a fantastic deal. Uh, very good deal. Let me just put that over here because I definitely want to feature that at that price. M&M jar for 16 Cute little shelf there for $12. That's a good deal. Nice little corner shelf, like however you want to do with that. Some more fantastic oil lamps. Parlor lamps, collectible plates. An old pair of shoes is another nice crock that's got a little chip on the lid there. This is neat. This just came in. It's like a slag glass kind of juicer. It's great color, 16. And you can see like the swirl in the colors there. I didn't find a maker's mark on it when I looked at it. It's a large one. It should, you might have to put, oh yeah, the, the center part, this one's has got a point to it. So you should be able to squeeze down on that. A lot of people when they come in, they still want to use them. So they're looking for ones that the edges are super sharp so they can really squeeze out their juice. Let me get the prices on these little teapots because I know I have tiny teapot collectors. So I have this cute little white one that is $8. Let's see, uh, no marking on the bottom. A little floral one here. It does have some crazing to it. Made in England. And that's been reduced from 22 to 18, it looks like. So that'll be $14.40. This little green teapot, that's just the tape, is just $8. That's made in Japan. It's got a couple little small flea bites on the rim. This one's $8. This is the kind of top where you kind of spin it till you get to the openings. And that has a marking on there that I can't quite make out. Shenango China. So this is a restaurant where this little blue and white teapot and that one's just $8. Nice old 
are these little kind of teapots for $17.60. It's just plain glass. I do have people looking for these in the restaurant wear, but I have not come across one yet. Another cute little teapot for eight. Let's see what our marking is on that. I believe that's another restaurant rare brand. Little white teapot for eight. Made in China. And we have a little orange teapot for eight. Let's see if I can get like an orange burnt rust kind of color. Feels like it's more glass than pottery. That's pretty. Let's see your little tag there. Small chip on spout for nine spic uh, 960. This is the famous little guy that you put the cactus in. They go for quite a bit more than that usually. He's just 960. It's very lightweight. Feels like he's a potter brand, but I don't see. Looks like Japan or what is that? Yeah, so he's just 960. And usually you would put your little cactus planter in there. What the heck's with the top of this? Very unusual for 12. There's a tight little uh, mature hairline right here that you can see. Unusual. Look at all the little, little holes on that. Okay, 32 on that, 1440. Nice little. This looks like it was. Uh, I think it probably had a tea strainer. It looks like it would sat across here and it's just missing the strainer. To me, that's what it appears to be. Missing a piece. So 64 World's Fair, the Empire State Building. 960. Ashtray for 960. What is this? What are you? Steamboat Middlesex Advertising Tray for 1760. Oh, there we go. The Bank of Middlesex from uh, 1975. And that was made in Frenchtown, New Jersey. So what a fun little local bit there. Pretty piece of glass right there for 2240. Has a beautiful blue bowl there for 12. Does have some wear of the silver, but not much. Very nice. This looks like a front of a ship mast to me, this guy, this hand carved guy. He is 60. He is large, not like super large, but large enough that he could have been on a good size little boat. Bookends. $20 for the reader man. It doesn't say for both, but it, I would imagine it is. I believe that's, he says man. Does he say man or men? Man. We'll have to confirm on that because that should be for both because it's their bookends. 24 on that camera. This one just came in. We don't get a lot of old cameras in here anymore. They do. They come, they go right back out. 16 for the Ag for Cadet box. I can't really open that with one hand. This guy is, as he's marked as is because he had the spring in there. He was the letter holder for you. And he is missing that at this point. This is just a little creamer with the lid, and that's $12 for the luster wear there. Very cute. And the shelf that these items are sitting on is for sale. And that is just $120 for the shelf. Very nice. That's a cute little guy. Look at this guy. A little butter dome dish here for $640. It's a good little deal, a little clear hobnail piece here for 480. Pineapple shaped toothpick holder for 12. Unusual piece of stangle for 16. Some more restaurant wear, Shenango. $12 for the sugar and creamer, that's a nice deal. It's the open sugar. We say restaurant wear because that's what used to be in the, they sold these to the restaurant and hotel uh, industries, uh, Shenango, Anchor wear. A lot of these brands specialized in that. So it's got a heavier weight to it. It's made to withstand a lot more use. So a lot of people collect that now, especially the, the harder to find that goes for a lot more is the railroad 
uh, restaurant wear pieces that you do find still. So 480 for this guy's gonna feature him Wednesday night if nobody pops on him tonight. He's not marked. This is like a little kid's wood handle. This is this is from the 1930s, 40s. It has the little glass top. This is glass. This little percolator for the kids. It's got glass and then this little wood handle, and that's just 480. And then we have some nice ephemera. He's got a lot of little cookbooks and such here as well. Eight dollars on the interesting wall pocket. 16 on that and nice mirror up there so this uh, is burning sensation antiques vendor code ugmo and they are a 20% off vendor this is we visited with this booth uh, second booth next to it and the larger booth on the other side as well as their two locked shelves in the front room so if you do want any more information on any of these items that I showed you in tonight's video any of our past videos any of our Facebook and Instagram posts Please do not reach out. Uh, do not hesitate to reach out to us. And uh, if you message us on Facebook or Instagram, I usually do answer pretty quickly, or I'll just let you know. I'll find that out for you when I get in the next day. So just if I acknowledge your message. But we also have a lot of people that email us, and they will give me the timestamp of when they saw an item in the video because that does help us quite a bit. Oh, I was looking. This was supposed to be on the live the other night, and I couldn't find the tag. So this is this cute little wood, uh, metal birdie, and he is just $4 from Auntie's Attic. So she's 20% off as well. And we just did Auntie's Attic, I think, last week. Last night we visited with uh, Good To Go on Second Thought and Lazy Q Ranch. And Tuesday night we had visited with Redreamable. Tonight, Friday, April 21st, we visited Burning Sensation Antiques. Again, you can find our information on how to reach out and purchase from us right in our about information as well as our web page so did I want to show you anything else I'm trying to think pretty sure that was it for tonight I got their items that were over here and I mentioned the event coming up you can see it's a beautiful day here so yeah that's gonna do it I'm gonna wrap up now and I hope you have a wonderful weekend